Alright, what is up? What is up? Don't, I don't know why I bought this game. And you're not going to be seeing anything new. But let me ask, are these all actual series? <laughs> ha! Like, I have never heard of any of this shit. I am so out of touch. Uh, I don't know why I bought this game, to be perfectly honest. I have no idea why I bothered purchasing this game. Because I have not... I did collect Yu-Gi-Oh cards when they were like brand new, uh, but I don't think I ever went beyond like the first, maybe the second series, and I obviously, due to that, uh, never got seriously into it. Plus, when it happened, I was like, shit, 12 maybe, 13, something like, you know, very, very, maybe even younger than that, I can't remember. But point being, trading card games cost a lot of money to get involved with right like you gotta buy pack after pack after pack if you want to get rares or alternatively you could just purchase the rares specifically from somebody that has them but generally uh you know if you're looking for multiple if you're only looking for one card that's brilliant but if you're looking for like oh i can get 20 i want 20 different cards here may as well just buy the packs uh but it costs a lot of money to get invested into a trading card game and to actually start seeing rewards and shit and you know Back then, I didn't have that money. I don't have. I didn't have a damn job. Shoot. So, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I am playing these, and I'm doing. They give you the option. Let me just skip this. They give you the option to use a user deck or a story deck. I've just been using the story decks, and let me tell you, I'm pissed about it. Not necessarily about the decks, but about just everything. So, like, the very first thing you do, you know, you're, you're coming in here, and I, I, I used to watch the Yu-Gi-Oh anime. I used to, uh. Be very involved with that, and I say very involved, I think I stopped once, like, the first arc finished. Like, once he finished that, you know, that bit where the actual tournament stopped and he beats Maximilian, and oh my god! And, uh, that, I, I don't think I continued to watch it after that, I can't, I can't remember. Anyway, uh, so, you know, you have that historic, nostalgic fight for me, right? Yugi against Seto Kaiba! The first big fight, you get to summon Exodia. And so I'm thinking, I'm going to use this story deck, and you better believe I'm going to use Exodia. And I actually got some dirty shit that allowed me to do it quite quickly. And I got rewarded with nothing. Not a goddamn thing. Not a special animation. Uh, I think I may have gotten a trophy, actually. But who gives a shit? I got nothing special. I got a text prompt on screen that said, Congratulations, you won by summoning Exodia or something like that. Like, that's it. That's all I got. How lazy you gotta be to not give this basically impossible, not impossible, improbable, to be perfectly honest, absolutely foolish, uh, win attempt here. And it's just like, nah. They really gotta be doing that right outside right now? I don't know if you heard that leaf blower. But anyway, um... What was I saying? I lost my leaf blower made me lose my train of thought. If I was in charge, were I a lofty producer or whoever makes that call, how would you not just be like, you obviously have license to utilize story stuff from here. Actually, you know what, it might be different. It might be different to like use resources from the series, from the game, versus like actually using, sh you know, licensing shit's kind of complicated. But barring licensing shit which it just occurred to me i may not understand in any way shape or form and it's pro it is very probable they might not even be able to do this but why would you not so like obviously you're in these story battles right there are certain ways that these story fights went down so if you try to stay more or less in line with how the battle went in the anime why would you not reward them with like the scene from the anime right so like you summon exodia against Kaiba and that's the entire point is like it's this incredibly improbable thing Kaiba never saw it coming it's ridiculous to do and so then you show like the actual scene from the anime of that happening right like that'd be fucking awesome that's how I design a game that's not how they design this game that's not how they design this game and then shortly after that I went on to fight the fucking bug dude who used fucking three swords of revealing light in a goddamn row on me I just dropped one it's like ah oh, fuck it whatever fine do you i'll build up my shit and so i start building up my shit and he starts building up his shit and then swords are revealing light goes away and then he puts down another one and i'm like are you fuck are you are you real are you serious thankfully i had a magic card that cleared out all his monsters so he couldn't get nothing special summoned on me so i used that shit 
And then he dropped another one! Another one! Are you fucking real? What is this AI shit? Why is this not limited to like one per deck? This is fucking stupid! Anyway... We move on past that. And then he uses another one! I wanted to murder somebody! And then, and then, and then. We continue on, we do some fights, we get to the fight where it switches shit on you instead of controlling, I think at that point you only controlled Yugi or uh, Joey, I don't think you controlled anybody else. But then they give you control of Kaiba to fight Yugi. And you're sitting there and you're like, man, I get to, I get Kaiba's deck, Blue Eyes White Dragon, I get to do the combination, the polymerization stuff, bring me that Blue Eyes Ultimate White Dragon or whatever the hell it's called. I know there's an Ultimate in there somewhere, I know there's a Blue Eyes in there somewhere, I don't remember if they could continue to call it White. Anyway, nailed that dude to a wall, right? You would think. No, he used that fucking sheep token bullshit. Summon four little sheepsies that I gotta barrel through before I move on. So I barrel through them. We move on. He uses another sheep token. And so I barrel through them. And then he uses another fucking sheep token. And then, and then, and then, and then he uses a Swords of Revealing Light. Are you fucking with me? And you know what? It was the most vindictive pleasure. I have ever had in my life, not really, but the most vindictive pleasure I've ever had in my life came from when I got a D spell card and I got to annihilate that Swords of Revealing Light and blow that motherfucker out of the water with my Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. You know what I'm saying? So we're gonna do this because obviously I am out of my mind. I'm livid. I'm pissed. I need tips. I need to understand how the fuck to play this game god damn it my let's be honest here like i said i used to watch this when i was young right you know how you kind of hit a point at some time you're just watching something and something just clicks and you're like oh 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 hey girl hey girl what's going on my valentine was my girl i i'm not really into the hentai stuff that those kids are into these days not really my jimmy jams but I will tell you what. If cartoony ass my Valentine came up to me and was like, hey baby, I'll be like, woo, let's go. That's my girl. That's my girl right there. Why do I have three of the same exact monster card that I can't do a goddamn thing with? Am I gonna have to use my own swords of revealing light right now? You can ritual summon this card with black luster ritual. I better have a goddamn lot of those black luster rituals. I don't want to use this because son of a bitch give me a second all right sorry we're practicing uh not practicing but we're testing and we're keeping individual programs open so i can find out uh what programs cause the capture to crash the way it's been doing and so now i have one so what is this when this card is activated add one elegant egotist from your deck or graveyard to your hand what the fuck is an elegant egotist during the end phase of this turn this card was sent from the f what this card was sent from the field or hand to the graveyard. Add up to three. Oh, when it gets sent. Okay. Add up to three harpy cards. Oh, this bitch with her fucking harpies. With her fucking harpies. And I can't even do a goddamn. Like, I don't want to use that. Because I'm just giving her 1,000 life points. We're just going to eat this. We're just going to we're just gonna hold whatever this is. Because I can't do a goddamn thing about it. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Oh sh oh shit! This is gonna this is gonna hurt. Am I gonna have to am I gonna have to be a bitch and use my own swords of revealing light because of this fucking terrible draw? Oh dear god. Oh dear god. It's not actually that bad. I'm being old. I'm being over. Are you serious? I am turning into exactly what I just hated. So let me use this shit right here. I could actually technically probably grab this dude. It's really not strong enough. Like the defense is good, but the attack is really not strong enough to waste that. That's a two. You gotta. You gotta. Oh, okay, I guess. Oh, and it actually gets more based on the harpies on the. So yeah, once I actually kill, like you gotta. That's a tribute summon that you gotta use two things for. But he didn't. But that didn't happen. But that didn't. That didn't happen. That didn't happen. Anyway, point being, that dude is not worth stealing because it's really not that impressive. 
but I still can't do a goddamn thing. <laughs> Woo! We love these story decks. They're so good. They're so good. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, dear God. What are you doing to me? That's not actually that bad. That's not scary at all. Oh, no. <laughs> Yo, it's a good goddamn thing. Uh-oh. It's not a good goddamn thing anymore. Am I actually dead? I'm dead. Oh, shit. I was waiting to use that for when, like, they were fully... Wow, that was a good battle. Good times, kids. That went well. Let's do this again with the story deck. Wow. That was awesome. Because, yeah, I was waiting to uh, break out. Wait, what did she use? She used rock, right? So let me just steal that. I believe I've only ever... Uh, that's only... This is the second time I've ever had two tries, but I think they use the same... Or no, I, I take that back. There was one that took me three tries, and they use the same thing every time, so I assume they pick the same thing. That is so much better. So much better! <laughs> could you just fucking give me that the first time? Now the question is, should I... Ooh, I could use that. Eh. That's what... This is what... This is the story thing, right? He put it on that shit. Fuck that. So the question is, do I want to... You know what? This dude can basically handle his business right there. And I'm just let it rock. At least I don't have three of these dudes. That, that's what I'm happy about. <sighs> oh, fuck your hoppy lady. It's gonna get... Uh-oh. No, yep, still fuck your hoppy lady. I don't... Oh, wait. Wait, wait. Why 2100? Why 2100? Why 2100? Hang on. That said... Oh, uh, what the fuck is happening? What is happening? I didn't even get to look at any of that shit. I didn't get to look at a goddamn thing that just happened right there. Uh, But my day just got fucked up. Hell yes, hit that. So, I guess we can just put this dude down as like a trap. Trippy trap! Or we can just put this dude down. Like, sacrifice. Yeah, let's make. Oh, no. Yeah. I just gotta wait for when this one will attack. And then I will care. Because obviously, there are no shenanigans in mind. I fucking hate this. I fucking hate this shit. When it does this. Oh no. Oh never mind. Never mind. Never mind. That's just that'll flip it over. They get to see so now they know what the fuck it is, but they can't do anything about it. I don't okay, Jesus Christ. Oh my god, this is the worst. It's the worst when you put something down like this. Like, oh my god, just stop. Just stop. Now yes. Seems kinda of foolish that they would well, I mean, I guess it's the same thing, like being scared of the threat of it. Versus, are you serious? You got another one? Bitch, got another one? How many of those motherfuckers do you need? What is this? Unite one of your own monsters on your side of the field in your hand with your deck and then shuffle it. Draw the same number of cards that were in your hand from the deck. Uh, unite one of your own monsters on your side of the field and your hand with your deck. And then shuffle it. So it's basically, is that just like a re... Shuffling, you just you get an all new hand, I guess. If I'm interpreting that correctly, uh, I think I I think it's worthwhile to just to just yeah, let's just let's just kill. <laughs> it's a shame I was not expecting a second fucking harpy's pet dragon that goddamn quickly, but I guess that is my deck. So we're just gonna have to hold that. No. Is it gonna do that to me? Like, is it just the existence of this now? Is it you know, fucking? I don't even know. So the question is, should I or shouldn't I? That'll keep me safe. I'ma do it. I'ma do it. It'll keep me safe. I mean, let's be honest, it's like, I recognize. Oh no, no, go fuck off, just fuck off, just go away, go, oh my god, I'm going to kill you. Seriously, like, the, ex the very existence of this card is now going to do that shit to me over and over and over. I'm about to throw a fit. I am about to throw a fit. Like a very real fucking temper tantrum from a grown ass adult is about to happen over these non stop button prompts. I am going to murder a baby. Like, just give me a button that I could do, that I could press. Just at any point in time. It's like, hey, now I want to activate this. And then you can fucking activate it instead of saying, oh, you just one thing happened. Now another second pass. Try this again. 
Um, shit, shit. Because that dude, that dude's gonna die, but hopefully we can... Because the AI's fucking stupid. So hopefully we can bait the AI into just setting a, uh... A card on offensive mode. No, I don't want to just fuck off. Just fuck you. Fuck you in the face! Yeah, see, you wouldn't have even been able to do anything there anyway. But yeah, just hopefully... No, Jesus, help me. <laughs> Please, Jesus, take the wheel and bypass all these button prompts. There's too many of them. Okay, I guess I can just... Oh, yay. Dude, I will murder you. I WILL MURDER YOU! Like, part of me wants to just activate it, just to fucking get rid of it. I wish you could just discard cards. No! Oh, Jesus! Like, I really legitimately wish it was possible to just discard cards. I would rip that shit up like it was Yugi's grandfather's blue eyes white dragon just so I didn't have to deal with these fucking incessant button prompts oh god what is that <laughs> it's so scary I don't like it I don't like it at all fuck you okay, you know what I'm actually gonna do let me just let me just summon this motherfucker Yes. Please God, yes. Let me just get rid of it. Like this is the end of the this is the end of like everything unless this trap card is ridiculous. This is the end of everything. That was so useful. That was so useful. <laughs> I cannot begin to describe how impressed I am with the effects of that card. It had so much self-importance just constantly fucking waving its dick in my face. Saying, activate me, activate me, and I get the card back that I just goddamn used. Are you serious? I'm gonna do one more. I'm gonna do one more. This is... Joey? Are we playing as Joey? If we are playing as Joey, obviously picking on the story deck is the brilliant way to go. Oh god, it is. Hey, I remember this shit! So, going second is always the best, right? Like, that's always the best... Is it? I don't know. I think it is because you get the first attack turn and you get to kind of react to the potential of what your enemy has versus just, oh god, I don't have a goddamn good thing right here. I actually don't know what this trap card is. Interesting. That seems very strong. It would seem stronger had I any worthwhile monsters to do anything with. Is this the Red-Eyes Black Dragon? Hell yes! That weak motherfucker that is not even worth summoning. 2400 strength got a tribute to cards. Totally worth it! So useful. This dude doesn't have any monsters? None at all. Fuck it then. Let's go in and see what the fuck happens. Cause I don't want to do like a direct attack and then trigger some like monster destroying thing. Or not attack because I'm scared of something and then like I summon the red eyes black dragon. And then he activates a fucking like kill card. <laughs> wow, okay let's just... Let's just have constant shit that we can set down to murder everything. Yeah, let's just set it. Who cares? You know what? Let's just flip this motherfucker. Who cares? He's so strong. 700 string. Totally, totally a worthwhile card to put in your fucking... Did I just go to end phase? I just went to end phase. That's my bad. Wow. Bandit Keith must have the worst luck of everybody.
What is happening? <laughs> oh, he just discarded a monster card. What is happening? There are some shenanigans that are occurring right now, and I don't like it. <laughs> I'm scared. Like, he's... He just discarded. Like, either he's dead here, or something is gonna happen that's gonna be fucked up. Like, he's gonna switch his life points with mine or some bullshit. I can't remember the story, so I don't remember story gimmicks. No, he's just gonna straight up lose. Why? What was that AI? Okay, never mind. We're gonna do another one. We're gonna do a second one because that was fucking weird. This definitely, damn it, suitably prepares you for real competition. For sure. There's no doubt about it. Oh, okay. Hello there. I still have not played that game, actually. I really should. I have too many games that take too damn long. Oh, God. I don't have good shit here. Wait, do I? No. Okay. I know this dude can s combine with something. I, I don't know what, though. I don't actually know what he can combine with. I might actually be entirely wrong. Oh, right from the get-go. That's good. This is promising. I don't even know what the fuck that is, actually. Oh, that's not that bad at all. I mean, it's bad in the sense that it's stronger than anything I got right now, but... Uh-oh. I mean, I guess we can just use this dude and do that coin flip shit. Obviously, we gotta go with Tails. Yes! Suck my dick! It's like I'm playing story mode right now. Or it's like I'm it's like I'm in the anime right now. I mean, I am playing story mode right now. Stupid. So I'm just gonna let this rock. I'm gonna let this rock. There's no point in wasting that shit on 300 damage. God damn it. Uh, it doesn't it's irrelevant if I set this dude. I'm gonna just fuck it. I'll just let it sit. Cause like he's gonna die. Right? Like if I set him he's gonna die. I'm not gonna be able to sacrifice him for the summon skull or the curse of dragon or uh oh. Please don't get another one of those. What? What is this AI right now? Like really, what is this AI right now? What did I just, what is this? Cool. You're another fucking, ah! <laughs> oh, what? Well, that's not gonna help me at all, is it? <laughs> it's not gonna go do a goddamn thing for me. All right, cool. We yeah, have, it's a good deck. It's a really solid deck. I would certainly not be already dead against anybody even moderately decent at this point in time over this fucking deck. Really? Nope. Not worth it over 900 damage. It doesn't matter because I don't have a fucking. You hate everything. Um, I mean, I may as well get rid of this. Actually, no, let's get rid of this dude. I don't know if that will ever come in useful in any way, shape, or form. I highly doubt it. That seems like a ridiculous gimmick card. But, I, and honestly, I still don't actually understand it. <laughs> Why would you? attack then use that thank god these fusion cards this dude has are not in any way shape or form scary 
Oh my god! Oh. No, that's still actually useless. I mean, I may as well use it, because why the hell not? But I still I can't do anything with it. I just want to see what the fuck I have. What is this? Uh oh. Wow. That is truly amazingly god awful. Oh boy, why am I using story decks? This is this is not a good look. I'm gonna set that card. So I think can I have five or six? I think I can have six. Okay, cool. Really? Polymerizations. Let me remind myself what cards I actually have here. God damn it. Oh, can I not do that? Never mind then. There we go. It has to be the specific prompt, I guess. Okay. Oh, that only affects one. I thought that affected all of them. That's my bad. What has happened? What is happening? Oh, dear God. <laughs> oh, no! Really? What is this deck? Oh, my God. I can't do anything. I can't do it. Like, I'm dead. If he gets one more monster card, I am dead. If he doesn't get a monster card, I'm still dead because there's nothing I can do. Yeah, I'm just gonna do it. Fuck whatever card you have down there. I'm blowing it up. Oh, blow up mine too. Ha! Ah! Didn't know that. Yay! I can do something. Kind of. Let me just set that. I don't know why. Who gives a shit? Right? Oh my god. Why would this motherfucker get a special? Can we talk about how bad those animations are too? <laughs> they bad. They're pretty bad. Must be fucking key. All right. What is this thing again? Cannot be no must first. By tributing one dark magician immediately after applying the effect of time wizard in which you called the time. Oh, so I need to have. I need to have one of these dudes on the field in the first place. So, my only shot right now is basically, I need to declare this fucking, I need to declare this correctly. Number one, I did not. I have just lost. We're gonna end on that, we're gonna end on that. Fuck whatever that was. 